just falling into a black hole. You're falling out of existence. No, you understand why a rogue black hole is so utterly terrifying. First, we need to understand what a black hole actually is. And the truth is, it's not what most people imagine. It's not a hole, not some cosmic tunnel or gateway. It isn't even really a thing. It's a consequence, a scar left behind after a star dies. When a massive star burns through the last of its fuel, it can no longer hold itself up. Its outer layers explode in a supernova, one of the most violent events in the cosmos. But what's left behind doesn't just disappear. The core collapses in on itself, crushed under the weight of its own gravity, folded tighter and tighter until all of its mass is squeezed into an unimaginably small point, a place with no size but infinite density. This is a black hole, not just massive, but fundamentally extreme. So powerful, it curves space. So dense, it slows time. So strange, even the laws of physics throw up their hands and surrender. Here's the haunting part. You could pass right by one of these and never know. It wouldn't cast a shadow. It wouldn't shine. In fact, if you swapped our sun for a black hole of equal mass, Earth would keep orbiting, calmly, silently, none the wiser, but come too close drift just a bit inward, and you'd cross a line that has no signpost, no warning, no escape. This is the event horizon, the point of no return. Once you pass it, your fate is sealed. You're not just falling into a black hole, you're falling out of existence.